every man's standards for a woman, it, it, at least initially, is as long as she just looks like she's somewhat physically healthy, she figured out how to turn a water spout on, um, so she doesn't stink, and she just exists without being a complete cunt. Those are the three basic <laughs> stand. If you sit me, Adolf Hitler, Bill Gates, Martin Luther King, fucking <laughs> Bruce Lee, <laughs> fucking Buddha, if you uh, Gandhi, if you sit all of us in a room together, we would all agree. Yes, <laughs> that's all. <laughs> She loves the fact that she she loves that he don't love her. Let's talk about this. Women are pointing out the obvious. They're not actually options just because there's a quantity of men who are thirsty. And here he is saying the grand old, you need to broaden your search, aka settle. Or sometimes they like to say expand their taste buds. The implication is there though, they expect you to settle. I don't know if you guys can read the bottom comment, but he says it there as well. Tons of men want relationships. Most women just go for the ones at the top that don't. And so what does it say? An abundance of men who can't commit. I feel so rich. Well, okay, yeah. Lots of men out there who can't commit. Broaden your search. Yeah, yeah, you need, yeah. But see, every woman is is, is a fucking stock market exchange with this shit. Like, and they, they, <laughs> they can't handle being, they, they can't handle realizing their actual worth and all, in, in the reality of the whole thing, right? Of the dating market, at least. Because, like I said, like with yo, I hate to go back to her because I think she was an admirable woman, but she suffers from the woman disease, right? Onyx. I hate to go back, bring use her as an excuse. Because, again, I thought she was admirable. I thought she was admirable. She fucking adopted four kids and she, you know, at least did something with her life to build herself up. And, you know, and she seemed like she was a well spoken woman. I, I, I have, I, I think she's admirable, but she suffers from the woman disease, right? Uh, she can't see what she's the reality of what she's actually worth in the dating market, and she doesn't want to settle. Cause again, okay, so who is this? Uh, Naked Soul eighty six eighty. I was born in eighty six. So yeah, she that bitch thirty six. <laughs> I was born. In, I was born in eighty six. I'm thirty six. Bitch, you thirty six years old. You too old to be talking about some. Yeah, okay, you need to realize, yeah, you need to broaden your search because the men that you looking for ain't looking for you, naked soul 86. Sorry to tell you that, but, I mean, it's only common sense, all right? If all these men, see, and, and see, th th this is the sad state of where, especially, like, you know, where, where I'm come from, this is the state where women are, are find themselves in. They can get that temporary validation, right? They, they'll, they'll get, you know, they're, they're going to get matches when they go on Tinder, right when they go on bumble whatever the fuck women are going to get matches women can be used as pump and dumps but they get that temporary validation of being desired and they get that confused with actual value at for for relationship status right and and that's what that's what hurts them but again like with onyx if she's so great if if, if this if, if naked soul 86 was such a great person she's so is she's such a great catch then how come all these men don't want to commit to her? Again, okay, so let's put it in perspective. Like, like I said with the Onyx thing. Let's say, let, let's say, and, and, and see, this is the only way you get women to see it. Let's say next year, right? Let's say next year, Lamborghini comes out with a new Lamborghini, with a new car, right? Let's say they come with a whole new line, right? But for some reason, everybody goes to the dealer, they buy it for a week, and then turn them, and they all get returned within the week, <laughs> right? But let, let's say, let's say, let's, say, let's Lamborghini, Ferrari, whatever. Let's say they they sell, they're selling all these cars, right? I mean, okay, well, I'm sorry, not now. But let's say in the past, they had they, they had a history of selling all these cars, right? When they were young, you know, years ago. But next year, they make a car, a whole line, cars, SUVs, you know, all this shit. And for some reason this year, everybody who's going to Lamborghini to buy the car takes it home, drives it for two or three days, and then ships it back to the dealer. Naked so what would be your reaction? Oh, something must be wrong with them Lamborghinis. They, <laughs> people ain't keeping them. Or let, let's break it down even more. Let, let's say purses. 
let's say, what's that shit? Uh, I can't even think of the person's name now. Philippe, Philip, Felipe, whatever the fuck. Let, let, let's say your favorite purse maker, Naked Soul, 86. Let's say your, perf, uh, your or, or let's say whatever makeup brand you use, right? Let's say all of a sudden, everybody who bought this makeup, it made it to headline news on Yahoo.com, CNN, whatever the fuck. Uh, let, let's say whatever makeup, I don't even know the name of makeups, but let's say whatever makeup brand you use, all everybody was buying it, use it for a week, and returned it because they didn't want to commit to what they bought. What is your first thought about that line of makeup? Something's wrong with it. <laughs> it looks good from over there, but as soon as you actually have to deal with it, it ain't right. <laughs> so it's time to ship it back. <laughs> That's what you are. <laughs> Something's wrong with you. If they... And on top, and what makes it worse, here's the thing, because men go through it too. But what, what makes it worse is that as a woman, you have the easiest thing to sell. Just be a woman. <laughs> just, just look like you can figure out how to turn a water faucet on to wash your face and wash your underarms. You know, just look like you can figure out how to turn a, a water spout on. Don't get too fat and just stand up. <laughs> and you can't get that right. <laughs> That's what makes it so much worse when women can't find a part of it. Because men, as men, a friend of mine, he came out from drive. I wanted to hang out with him. We hung out with these girls. And I was telling the girls, like, look, see, as men, and they told they, they were they were they were seemingly agreeing with me, you know. As a man, as a woman, all you got to do is stand up in the corner and a man is going to come try to come by you. Right. For lack of for that's the reality of what the whole transaction is. Let's be real about it. I mean, you can get mad. Oh, you're not to be bought. But that's what it is, because you don't want a man who's got lesser than you. You want a man who's got more than you. Right. So that's what it's just being hidden. It's all prostitution. You're just hiding it and go about it in a different way. Right. But as a man, see, the reason why it, the reason why men go through it is for is for de much deeper reasons that women just cannot understand until a guy like me or a man who's better than me explains it to him as a man if i go up and approach a woman first off the woman may just not like me that's cool or the one or i may look like somebody that she didn't like from three years ago whatever the fuck which is cool totally fine right but then the shitty parts come in i'm supposed to know how to be funny but not too funny how to be sympathetic, but not a pussy. How to be caring, but not a pussy. How to be, you know, funny I, and all, and it just keeps going. And I, and I have to get lucky that it matches up with this one individual woman that is totally different from the next 90 walking down the street. You see what I'm saying? See, so men have a much harder challenge in finding a woman because a man gets judged on so many deeper whereas on, on the flip side a woman her as long just don't be fat like you can figure out how to as the, every man's standards for a woman it, it, at least initially is as long as she just looks like she's somewhat physically healthy she figured out how to turn a water spout on um so she doesn't stink and she just exists without being a complete cunt those are the three basic <laughs> stand. If you sit me, Adolf Hitler, Bill Gates, Martin Luther King, fucking <laughs> Bruce Lee, <laughs> fucking Buddha, if you uh, Gandhi, if you sit all of us in a room together, we would all agree. Yes, <laughs> that's all. <laughs> You use me, Hitler, Joseph Stalin, Martin Luther King, George Bush, George Washington, fucking George Henry, everybody, George on the. If you said the, the most widest groups of men from all different walks of life, from third world countries to living in penthouses to 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 go to, to astronauts to deep sea divers to NFL players. To, <laughs> To hobos on the street, to men addicted to heroin, to men who were sexually assaulted and abused or whatever. To If you got every man from every single walk of life, we all would be able to agree that those three things are essentially the core. That's all he's looking for in a woman. And after that, we can make 
a good time after that. <laughs> right? That's it. <laughs> you know? That's it. Women don't realize how easy they have it. Because like, cause, cause they, they can't because they've lived it. So when you try to tell them, well, they just think you're just full of shit, you know, and, and, and all that, until they get older and they, and they lose all their youth and beauty, then they start to get hit by it. But as, as long as she's, you know, looking like this. Comment, but he says it there. It's never been an As long as she's looking like her, she, you can't tell her anything. You, you can't tell her. You can't tell her shit. Because the world revolves around, it's revolving around her right now. You can't tell her shit issue of people who don't want a relationship is people who aren't relationship material and yes my standards which i have you should have and is normal to have which by the way they have too but theirs are just really low this narrative of oh all the girls just want the top 20 percent why can't they just settle for the bottom 80 no how about you come up here why don't you stop being below average the industry well we'll wait give it about 10 years when you get below average <laughs> <laughs> and you be on there talking like her. <laughs> Nobody's committed. You be a like Anna Akana. Nobody's committed to me. <laughs> Wish it got old. <laughs> Telling people to put in the effort in themselves, work on their mental health, and get plastic surgery is going to the wrong group of people. The wildest thing about men who subscribe to this ideology is how pervasive it is in the face of women and people actively communicating. This is not the same thing. Like, what is this? So it says, it feels like this is kind of true and also kind of not. I know women who feel like they have no options in the, in the way I sometimes do have. They feel like they have no options because they only want the same top 20% of guys. Well, yeah, that's true. They have a, a thousand options, but they don't want them. Some of Fogs Fest says, I think some are running into the problem that they have no way of meeting men and refuse to go on dating apps. I know them personally. Most decent women, most decent looking women have so much more options than decent looking guys. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Because see, and, and again, like I mentioned probably about a month ago. The, here, here's, the, here's the really sad part about women, too. Well, I told those girls when I was hanging out with a friend of mine in Germany. I told her, I, I feel sorry for women, ultimately, in the end. It's because, it's because women have no power over maintaining anything of value longer than 15 minutes. 15 minutes at a time whereas men main, can maintain shit for 15 years and that's why women always have to break down and put on 15 pounds of makeup to go find a man and take care of shit because women can't keep shit sustainable for longer than relatively speaking 15 minutes at a time everything about a woman's life is temporary right <clears throat> because because they know deep down they can just go fucking get out the problem right but they get stuck in that mentality and they never grow right and see, this is what keeps women trying to hold on to femininity up because they know that's the truth, but they don't want to admit it. None of them do. <clears throat> and like I said about two months ago, it goes back into that theory. Like the older they get, well, after like when I drew the, the whole thing on the iPad, how it all works, you know, she starts out life pretty much like at the top of the game in a dating market. Women start out life in the top of the game it's, it's especially in comparison to that to this the same quality of man that that she is right women are, are immediately at the top and then it just slowly goes down ever there is not one statistic that proves otherwise women start out the dating market up here whereas men start out down here and if the, if men can fuck around and figure it out they climb but a lot of men don't for whatever reason but but no matter what a woman does she keeps going down right because one is partly her nature for always wanting to keep going up but her values in being young and she can't fight off age father time but like i said in the, in the video a while back with the ipad the older the woman gets have you ever noticed this the older the woman gets the, the higher her requirements get but at the same time the lower her actual value in the dating market gets which is why naked soul 86 can't find a man to commit to her she could be used as 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 as, as a as a cum dump but nobody's gonna sit down with her she's a factory she's a she's a factory car reject that's got shipped back to the distribution center at this point right and it was and, and it was a 15 year old car on top of that leaking oil but but because she's 36 so at, at, at naked soul 86 at this point like i said in a video two or three months ago she's gonna want 
Derek's job, Randall's car, Sean's sense of humor, uh, 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 Patrick's fucking bank account, uh, Donald's family money, uh, uh, I don't know, Eric's fucking uh, 401k, and you know she's going to want all the tops of all the cocks that she bounced on while she was in her late teens and early 20s to where now she wants this 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 mythological man that just doesn't exist one or if he does exist he's going to want nothing to do with the, with a woman of that age chances is, is a good chance <laughs> right you see cuz like i said in that video 2 months ago men we do the same thing but we get over it much quicker right because so let's say when a guy is 19 and a girl's 19 a 19 year old girl is wanted by every man from ages 5 to 155. Every man wants a 19-year-old girl. But a 19-year-old guy, he's going to have a hard, much harder outlook. Much more grim outlook. So by that point, you know, we've been seeing porn and all this shit. So, you know, so once you watch enough porn, you start to, you know, I like this this woman's tits with this legs and this hairstyle. Then you get lucky and find a woman who has all that. Then you kind of grow from there, kind of create this, you know, this perfect porn woman. But in reality, most at 19, most men just are not going to have access to that. Unless your family works in porn or something, and you can, you know, fuck a porn actress like that, which is super rare. Most 19-year-old guys are just not going to have that option. So we outgrow it. We develop much quicker in adulthood than women, right? Whereas women at 19, oh, if she just hangs around a college, a university bar long enough, it's just a matter of time before, you know, or, or she, you know, hangs out with some cheerleading squad, or if she just keeps hanging out in bars or clubs, she's going to eventually, you know, ride, you know, some dream guy's cock at some point and then make that her new status, right? Like, cause, again, because women have the easiest thing to sell. They don't, all they got to do is just exist with loud music, stand there with long hair, and, and dim lighting and she's fuckable that's it she's woman so she sells whereas men we don't get that but on the back end like i said they end up like naked soul the older she gets uh, they're going to like onyx naked soul uh what's the other one i can't think of the other uh, lolo jones they're going to like them this olympian of a man that they're looking for if this guy, if if this guy is is half as good as what she's looking for now, he's not gonna waste time on a woman of this age. But guess what? She ain't settling for less, and she's gonna hold on as long as she can. <laughs>